Are you working? What kind of work do you do? The world's leading luminaries, visionaries, and entrepreneurs reveal the secrets to wealth, happiness, and a deeply meaningful life. What I've had to overcome, and it's not over yet, <laughs> it's a constant process, is self-doubt. Every single person has challenges, and it's not the challenges that matter, it's what you do about the challenges. Get a clear sense of what your values are. Live by it. Everybody wants money. With money you can buy things that bring you happiness through a good deal of work. If you do elect me, you will work. But not too much. I understand you, not too much work. Work brings you away from your family. Family is the root of society. You don't want to work, you do want money. More you will have money, more you will be happy. That's uh, mathematics, you know? Happiness is richness. Now, do you want to be rich? Now, then vote for me. If the world and the outside is guiding you, then you can become a sheep and you miss the truth. We're always doing the best we can. We can do better. Sometimes I've made decisions based in integrity. For those decisions, I, I've been able to be thankful, but also that they've helped me to evolve some. You know, but then all the other decisions still hold me back. It's true. There's a great story that's told about a Cherokee elder who was talking to his grandson and telling his grandson that the human condition is like we have we each have a battle inside of ourselves and the battle is between two wolves one wolf is the wolf of unhappiness it's the wolf of fear and anger and jealousy and frustration and the other wolf is the wolf of love it's the wolf of gratitude of appreciation of kindness of generosity of forgiveness of compassion and the grandson says, well, which wolf will win? And the grandfather says, whichever one you feed. I think we're just afraid. Every spiritual teacher talks about fear as one of the most potent enzymes that gets in the way of our joy and our love and our liberation. Well, quick, in almost every case, they give up on their dream. They think, you know, that if they haven't achieved it quick enough, they're also afraid of failure. Afraid to keep going. You only have failure when you quit. If you want to change your life, question any fear that would keep you from living the life that you want to live. And what's to stop you from living it at that point? If you question what you believe, what can possibly stop you? Embark on a quest to ignite the spirit, awaken your passion, and turn your dreams into reality. Questforwealth.org